Hey guys, so I wanna share a concept with you that I like to call resetting the room. And when you're working on a project, especially if it's one that's not in a house that you live in, let's say you're making your she shed out in the garage. Um, what can happen is you start to have things kind of all over the place. In this case, you can see this room has a lot of tools and just various things. Now what happened was I needed to move a bunch of stuff um, out of another project space and it all kind of congregated here because this wasn't being used. So before I do anything else, because the project behind me needs to get some work and then obviously this room needs work, uh, we're gonna do what I call resetting the room. So in this case, what you would do, what you can do, is to collect all the tools, put them in one spot, collect all the, um, all the parts, all the supplies, put them in another spot. Uh, perhaps you're even gonna, you're gonna sort and organize them. I wouldn't spend a lot of time on it, just enough that you get all the, the cut pieces picked up and thrown away or burnt or whatever you're gonna do with them. Um, in this case, I'll show you, I'll walk downstairs take a, an extra 30 seconds and I'll show you a little bit about how I'll reset this room right now. And I had some saw horses and a board. You can use a door, maybe you've got a door taken off. Uh, that always works really well. And I'm just kind of sorting this stuff by bulk layer. Um, I'm not gonna need the painting things for a little while. And the electrical is here on the end because I will need that a little bit um, I want quick access to it, but I don't really need that much. I'm gonna get more of the, the packaged tools and I'm gonna line them up here. Again, I can get to them if I need them, but uh, I know that for the most part, I don't need a lot of that stuff. And the rest of the things that are up there, it's all gonna come down here. It's gonna be placed and sorted, nice and clean and neat, so that it's accessible, but it's also out of the way for now because eventually I'll be working and finishing up in the basement and that stuff will need to come out. And that's just part of projects. A lot of times you need all of those tools, you need all of those, those pieces um, and you need them at different times and it really helps once a week perhaps to take a moment, reassess what's going on, make your new punch list and also understand where your tools are. Get them all collected, put them back in the places that they that they go, uh, and that's absolutely going to save you time and frustration later. So tomorrow, I'm going to come into work. I can get to work, and I don't have to be stepping over, stepping around, or even at that point looking for the tools that are needed to get the job done. So that's thought for today. Reset your room. Uh, I use this concept with my truck all the time. Anytime I stop for fuel. I make sure that I clean out all the empty cans and if there's any wrappers or anything from little sna uh, road snacks, I always throw it all away and the truck stays much cleaner, much neater uh, than it had been before and that just makes me feel good. Uh, do the same thing here in the, in the room. Uh, maybe you just do it in your, in your regular life all the time. Uh, right before you go to bed, you clean up all the dishes in the sink and you know the next morning you're uh you get downstairs and your brain's not all frazzled i guess that's the make your bed uh thing wake up make your bed your brain's feeling really good about accomplishing something and when you come back it's not all crazy and you feel really good about how everything looks so um that's it i'm gonna let you guys go this is a longer one today i hope you're in mind um we're we're resetting the, the space and I've got a whole bunch of really fun content coming up, so I can't wait to hear what you think about it. All right, let's build.